we have a map now where uh, where we're, we're pulling in information from the Bing Map service, which is a, a web hosted service uh, that Microsoft provides, and we're putting our data on top of those maps as we go. So uh, here we have the same kind of sales information, and we can change to different metrics like average selling price. But in, in addition to the rest of our visualizations, we're customizing this by showing the uh, geographical boundary of the regions that our stores are organized into. If I'd like to use the filters, I can certainly do that and choose, for example, just one category of light duty cogs and see um, how, they're, how the sales of light duty cogs have done. Um, over the country by region and I can see that uh, three of the regions are doing well one of the regions is is not as well as the other so so this provides a new dimension on top of a standard kind of uh, numerical dashboard um, but you know let's take that even a little bit further so so what I'll do now is choose from my filters a particular state so as I apply that I will get a map that zooms in on California and this is a very interactive kind of a map so it's not just a static picture but I can see my data overlaid over the state of California and these are all of my stores and their KPI status within any of these uh, KPIs that I see so if I want to look at which stores are doing the best in terms of maintaining gross margins um, and which aren't doing as well I can do that this gives me a much richer picture than I might get if I was just showing a list of stores with uh, with the data points and I can drill in on this in even more detail uh, maybe what I'd like to do with this is to bring it up and look at it even closer so if I click on the heading I'll get a full screen view and now I get a little bit more navigation up here as well and things I can do and I can look at the entire state I see a few red spots so maybe I'd like to zoom in on that um, and look at that if I hover I can get more information about individual stores again we're going for a lot of interactivity a lot of data displayed on this map and even maybe I'd like to look at a satellite photo of that store and see what it looks like and, and maybe what's located around it such as this auto facility here And I can zoom out. When I'm finished looking at that, I can certainly just go right back to the dashboard where I started. And then maybe choose a different state that interests me. Or a different metro area. Maybe the Chicago metro.